Hello everyone, this is Roman here to talk to you about the EEB Mate uh, live from my office, as you can see. We have here the beautiful blue and rare uh, EEB Mate. I have it plugged in currently to my ITM in my office um, so that I have full power, not based off of a battery. Um, I am plugged into a 3000 pulse expansion valve head. As you may notice, I am missing the bottom half of the body. I have the valve here with the top cut away to where you can actually see the gears inside of the actual head. And what you'll notice is that as it spins the top, you've got three gears that modulate and rotate around based on how the top modulates. If you look here at the other valve I have listed below, I will then modulate it. You'll notice the gear teeth on the inside of the valve. Like I said, this is a 3000 to 6000 pulse expansion valve. You'll find these on all branch selector boxes as well as all our latest model VRV4, VRVX, Aurora outdoor units as the main outdoor heat exchanger expansion valve. You'll notice as I change my revolutions on my actual EEV mate that it modulates the valve on the inside. So with that being said, you can actually pull this out, which might actually take two hands. Set you up here. And set it down on top of our expansion valve. So as you noticed before, you've got gears on the inside that then go down into the center here and turn three inner gears around the center that drives that shaft. This just slides up and over the top like so. This slides up over top of that. And we pop our EEV on top. Click means it's in, let's drive it. Let's see if I can zoom in here for you. Slowly but surely, one of the slowest valves we have, and that's just due to the amount of actual range we have for control, you will notice the valve is slowly seating. And you might wonder why well, I can't hear it operating. And that is the common complaint with these larger size valves. So I went ahead and took the liberty of getting a mechanical mechanic stethoscope, which I have plugged in here. Off, on, off. Turbo mode. As you can see, I'm driving a lot faster. And now I'm closed. And 
that is the sound you will get when this valve is 100% closed. As you can tell, I can't go any further. That is 100% closed. You will get the same noise when you're 100% open. When the gears can no longer turn and the center can no longer oscillate and spin. And what's it sound like in turbo mode when it's closed? Let's hear what it sounds like when it's opening. The sound we've all come to love and know with the 2000 Pulse gear driven valve. Turbo. Voila, the sounds of the EEV.